Hello everybody, and uh, welcome to Devious Dungeon. Um, this game is coming out on Steam tomorrow. Uh, so, uh, how do I access the settings there? I guess I'll just use a mouse to click around. Uh, so we got music, sound effects, that seems to be it. Uh, okay, let's just uh, start. Um, As the story is told, dark times upon Hilltop Castle. An ancient evil has awakened in the catacombs underneath the castle. The king sends all of his men to destroy the evil lurking below. But the dungeon is deadly and is constantly shifting. Only a true champion will be able to save the day. Alright, so uh, sounds like it's a pixelated uh, random random levels. Uh, the, the jumping and slashing kind of... Uh, okay, well, I didn't see what they said. Boring! Um, we can't slash the king. Player portals, that brings up the map, okay, and I am not lost, I get an achievement for bringing up the map for the first time, alright, we can't actually see the king or talk to the king as far as I am concerned, maybe walk up to the king and press up, nope, poor ring, okay, he's not too excited with the, press A to purchase goods from Olaf's shop, okay, so the interactive characters, you can just jump in front of their face and that counts, alright, so we can buy a weapon, we got a rusty sword. All right, and armor. Um, we don't have armor. That costs money to buy. Potions. Everything's locked, but uh, clearly we'll be able to buy some. We got rings and amulets. So pretty basic setup. Uh, let's get out of here. Okay, I am using a controller. It seems like the I used to be an adventurer like you. Good luck down there. So this is enter the dungeon. All right, all right. Uh, select a portal. Well, I can only select level one, but it looks like there's a boss after level ten and twenty-three and thirty-six and forty-nine and sixty-two. Well, even if you don't uh, die down there, you get you know, beaten up to death from, uh, all right, tutorial. Okay, so we got jump. Okay, we can hack away and hold it to jump higher. Okay, got it. Hold the B button to swing your weapon. All right, so you can hold it instead of and destructible lamps and pots. It's starting to feel kind of like maybe, maybe, just maybe, uh, Rogue Legacy. Press down and A to drop through platforms. All right, uh, any secrets? All right, well, I don't know. All right. Uh, I guess I, I, I wish the objects didn't take three hits to destroy. Keep an eye out for hidden air. Oh, hey, I was just looking for hidden areas. So that is, all right, okay. Okay, you gotta hack that, that and give you some money. Well, is there a... Okay, well, I guess it's not so much of a hidden area if it's already exposed, but maybe just in a tutorial it is. I wish these things only take one hit to get rid of. Uh, if you get lost, open your map. Right, we did that earlier, and it told us that... Alright. Wow. Uh... I, I don't know what I was thinking, right? I was thinking... I was hoping that the enemy would die in one hit. Find the key in each level to open the gateway to the next level. Okay, so we found the key. Quest complete, reward 30, and we just jump into the portal, and now we're officially level one, or into the level, into the first level. Um, I keep on trying to see if there's any way to defend. Uh, <laughs> it 
take a little time to get used to uh, the actual controls. I want money. I want money now. Okay, can't go down there. I want money so that I could go buy stuff. Oh my goodness. Well, looks like I'm gonna die before I can actually go buy stuff. Just gotta be a little bit careful. We can't drop down there, right? I assume I'll take it damage. Oh, you can go through these platforms. Very good. Okay, so I know I can hold and kill this dude. Alright, so there's the portal out. Okay. Oh, can't go there right now. Quest complete. Reward 30. What quest? Oh, was the key in there? Give me money! Give me money! Uh, secret area? I don't know. Maybe there's not a secret area in every zone. Can you look down? You can't look down. Okay, so... I just don't want to fall into a spike pit is all. Oh my goodness. I keep on taking damage. So when you level up, I guess you get a... So we want strength? Stamina or dexterity? Let's we'll just go for strength. It seems like. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, maybe I should have gone for HP. Oh my goodness. What? A lot of enemies hit really hard. I suppose that's what, uh, why you want to buy some armor from the starting, oh boy. As you can see, I'm not very skilled at this game. You didn't need me to tell you that. You could just observe and quietly giggle to yourself. Alright, we're back here. Oh, there was a, there was a little area down there that it didn't explore take the chance no fall damage okay good to know it's really easy to take damage in here oh my goodness I think I should oh and there's contact damage as well so um, I should All that money that's just dropping down into the pit of no return. All right, I haven't found the, uh, the key yet, so I don't know why it kept on telling me that uh, my quest was done. Maybe it's specific uh, achievements, right? Like, so I see the key up there. I haven't seen a... Wow, what a oblivious enemy that doesn't turn around once you, uh... Hmm. Let's see... Oh, I don't think there's any... I am. I don't see any hidden areas. Let's... Let's get out of here. Wow. Um, I might not make it to level 3, guys. With my... very lacking in the door was up here right oh no that was the f start the door was up here okay yeah no 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 health reset so i better be careful with what i do with my health leveled up okay so leveling up at least gives you uh, a health refill. That's good to know. 
I'll just keep on going strength. I don't know which one's better, health or crit. Uh, I thought I could cheese that with a little bit of uh, staying out of the way and attack. Oh my gosh. Uh, staying out of the way and attack. Okay. But instead... Looks like I'm getting some money just for killing things on a schedule. Alright, I'm able to kill those guys in... Oh man. Yeah. I shouldn't worry too much about money, I think. I think I'll just, uh, you know, sort of... cheese things however I can. I, I really wish the uh, environmental objects would take just one hit. I mean, three hits makes it so that I'm just not very inclined to go after it. Alright. I guess unless I get experience, but... Oh boy. Ah... Uh constrained by my jump there. Oh, hey. Um, we'll just keep on going strength. I want to get to a point where I can one hit some people. Uh, at this rate though, uh, I'm most likely going to die. I really wish... Uh, again, I'll stop complaining about the multiple hits it takes. Gotta remember, I can just pass through. Okay, the game doesn't lock you into uh, a, a standstill uh, by attacking. Olaf's caravan, level four. Okay, it's funny you have to do this jump. Okay, so we can jump. We can buy stuff now. We can buy. Uh... Uh, that's 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 probably like a DPS downgrade, isn't it? 12 damage, speed 2, versus 10, speed 3. So probably don't want to do that. Do want some armor. Uh... Oh wait, why did that unlock? Oh, why? Why? Why didn't that unlock? I don't know. Now I feel cheated. Uh, because Olaf had the materials, he didn't want to give it to me until I bought something that was cheaper. Uh, do we just want to go for a higher up armor or, you know, we'll buy one ring. Why not? Money is very arbitrary. Why is it, uh, we'll buy amulet too. Why not? Okay. Uh, strength and stamina versus stamina and dexterity. Uh, we're going for a strength build, so we'll do that. Alright, now I'm out of money. Wait, did how much were the potions? Too expensive. Gotcha. Press to receive a 
Oh. Ah. Well. Don't have enough money to receive a healing from the priest. It's a very greedy priest. Alright, hopefully... Oh, I like the... Okay. Uh, the area looks kind of icy, but uh, I'm not sliding around. Uh, to be honest, I'm not really ready to be sliding around in this game yet. So I'm glad that I'm not sliding around. Oh, there's... Are these like achievements or something? That's a HP up? Uh, I'm sick of taking silly damage. And now, now I feel even more pressure. Oh, his sword has a longer reach than mine. Not fair. Okay. Now I feel even more pressure to get money. Uh, because it's not how much money you have that determines how much you can buy. It's how much stuff that you've purchased with your money beforehand that determines what the merchant will actually offer to you. So that is something I would probably change. I mean, there's absolutely no reason why make the player buy lower tiered stuff when all that's going to be faced with them uh, after the purchase is deep regret in um, we'll kill this uh, for a little bit of XP and go. I was trying to jump across that door but the door automatically sucks you in if you're already jumping. Still four hits for these guys. But uh, fortunately, I am getting a little used... What is all this? Quests? What was that? Was that was a crit. Okay. So crit gives you a screen shake. Which means I even want to just up my damage because I don't want to see a ridiculous amount of screen shake. That should be an option. Because... If I don't want to see a screen shake, I really don't want to see a screen shake. Uh, because it's not one of those games where you, you really need to be reminded of the fact that you got hit. Oh, these guys have... Oops. Fortunately, there's no uh, fall damage. Okay, I can hit faster, which is great. Oh my goodness, these guys with daggers are super quick. Okay. I don't think you have to hack at the walls to get into a secret room, but I certainly haven't seen one yet, so... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I... Yeah, I didn't come over here. Oh, I meant to jump back over and kill that guy first. No! Give me my potion back. I don't like the fact that... Oh, man. I don't want, I don't want the contact damage. What was that hitbox? I thought I was underneath the path of the arrow. Maybe I wasn't. Clearly there are some... Uh, exit. <laughs> Can't get to the exit yet. And... Yeah, I hear arrows being fired. Oh my goodness. Well, that did not work out in my favor, did it? I'm still bummed about the fact that uh, you have to... Uh, actively buy stuff that's lower tier before the higher tier items will be even available to you. That seems like an unnecessary type of grind. I really want to know what happens when I jump down there. So let's try it. Okay, will you lose health? Actively lose health. So it won't be doing that again. But at least it's not an instant death. I just assumed that it would be instant death. So I gotta save 50 to heal. Let's heal up. 
I don't really want to die. Um, let's do... I do have enough to buy that higher grade armor. Oh shoot, this means I have to buy this wooden club? Even if I don't want it. Well, doesn't that suck? Um, I guess I will... Uh, I'm not sure what I should do. I guess I'll buy the club because I want better weapons. Even though I don't want the club. I want the higher speed. Uh, well, we'll go for the steel sword next time, I guess. Uh, do I have enough? I don't have quite enough for any kind of uh, potion of health. I don't... There's not an inventory, so... If I buy a potion of health... Does that... Alright, for experimentation's sake, I'm just gonna see what happens. Magic Brew. I have no idea what that did for me. Um, and of course, our... Maybe... Oh, actually, the... The, the club has a... The club seems to have a pretty good range. So... Maybe it's just me. We're into the third biome. And... Uh... Okay. Seems... And a different kind of enemy. He'll probably turn around and hack at me. I really didn't want to get hit by that big axe. So, uh, let's go up here. See what's up here? That should be a secret room, shouldn't it? I don't know. Oh. It's a wizard. Uh, oh boy. His fireballs go through. Uh, there's. Okay. First secret. Was that a XP? Knowledge is power. Um. Okay. Yeah. Stamina gives you HP. I'm just gonna keep on going strength. I think at some point I have to go with crit, but uh, I really don't like the screen shape. Uh, okay, you can die now, thank you. Uh, it still takes three hits to kill one of those guys. Oh man. We got faster enemies. That will put me into my grave, I'm sure. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, the contact damage is... Frustrating, to say the least. Trying to just maximize my uh, money there. Ah, seems like a lot of work for a little bit of money and possibly money I'm not even going to be able to use. Well, those guys are a lot easier to kill. No, I really want. Oh boy. I think his range is still... The range is still bigger than mine. Uh, uh, I was thinking maybe that was a secret room and you had to just trust yourself. Trust your judgment, apparently. 
my judgment was incorrect. Anyway, so, um, looks like this game is just going to keep on going with its many, many levels, which is kind of nice. I mean, we've already seen three different biomes, uh, uh, different tile sets. I mean, the actual gameplay doesn't feel a whole lot different. Oh boy. Those are my worst nightmares when it comes to Super Mario Brothers and, uh, I don't remember what those, those, those dudes that throw axes are called, but I just figured he'd be throwing a projectile at me, not in a parabolic shape. I was expecting like the arrow, uh, like a straightforward thing. There we go. The fact that you have to hack at a ch oh no, the fact that you have to hack at a chest to open it up is a little odd. I want money. Give me money. Or I was going to say give me money or give me death, but uh, most likely I'm going to die before I... Oh, in the process of collecting money anyway. Okay. Let's see how these guys act. Oh man. It's not a, it's not a set trajectory of their is not a set trajectory of their axes. It actually is they aim it at you. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh wow. I want to level up so I could get my health up, but it might be... Ooh. It's okay if I don't live through this. I just gotta take, take things a lot more carefully. We are close. We are close. We are close. Maybe one or two enemies and I can live to see another day? Oh no. Oh gosh. Not this guy. Oh, let's try to avoid it. Didn't work. Gloria, wait, resurrect. Um, can I look at statistics anyway? Nope. It just uh, starts you right off. Oh, 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 oh! It gives you money. Oh, all those quests that we completed. So I'm definitely going up on the sword. And it really sucks now I have to go for a higher damage, lower speed weapon before I see the next one. Let's just see it. Wait, no, no, no. I actually want to use each item for a little bit. But I will buy the higher grade armor. Shopaholic achievement. That's probably for spending a thousand in the shop. Um... Potion of Strength. Oh, this is this a permanent increase? Wait, wait, wait. Is this... This might be a permanent increase. Which would be pretty awesome, actually. Then it's really going to feel like... Uh... Okay, now I guess it's okay. I, I, if I understand this correctly, this would sort of more closely resemble um yeah i'm level six wait 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 i think this just needs yeah it says i'm level six i didn't lose any of my all right well that makes it 
little bit easier to tolerate. Uh, so it's not a roguelike. It's not even it's not a rogue legacy. It's just a permanent upgrade. Okay, now all of a sudden, I feel like it's just a, a campaign. Okay. And I guess we'll just keep on going strength. Um, we're going for a pure strength. Oh no, what kind of a hit was that? That was a lousy hit, if that's what it is. All right. I really don't think you should lose a bunch of health for, uh, you know, jumping in after a wolf and making contact with a wolf's tail as it's running away from you. But that's okay. That's something I can get used to. Uh, I'm just thinking about logistics, but then again. Since when did I ever think that uh, video game logic has to make sense? Especially when it comes to platformers. Um, uh, so crit? I do want as much money as I can now because it's just a literally a power up. Oh no. I take way too much damage. I've got the key. Is that the exit? Yeah, that's the exit. Let's go. So I guess this is a just a straight up platformer with randomized oh uh, randomly generated levels and uh, save progression. I guess if I didn't click resurrect, I don't know what would have happened, but I, I don't see why there any reason not to resurrect your character once you die. Uh, makes every sense to do that instead of uh, instead of having to start over but I think you you certainly can I mean certainly make a lot more money uh, exit here okay secret room nope okay There's the key. Yeah, let's just grab the key and get out. Oh, there's a secret room here. Oh, okay, right at the front. What was that? Uh, it looks like a tomato. Maybe it was a heart. All right, let's just go for the exit. Okay, I don't need to be so careful. Uh, once I find out that it's not a roguelike and there's no permadeath, you know, I, I stop being so worried about dying. It's just everything saves your experience, uh, your equipment, your levels. But it makes sense that it's not a roguelike. Otherwise, uh, imagine how long each run would be and how repetitive. Silver coins. I want the silver coins. But uh, not for a health price. Oh boy. My neighbor's dog seems to be Barking like 
crazy. I, I don't know what that's all about, but I, I, they're, they have a lot of animals, and uh, yeah, some days it gets really loud. Some days, there's not really anything you can do about that. Uh, I think... What's over here? Nothing. Okay. There's absolutely nothing over here. Do I have the key yet? I don't have the key yet. Uh, I gotta go find the key. I came up here, yes? Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. I'm also a complete klutz when it comes to recognizing... Uh, uh, why did I fall down that pit? I'm also a complete klutz when it comes to recognizing sense of direction, or time, or just remembering anything in general. I have a terrible memory. But why am I telling you this? I don't know. Got nothing better to say, I guess. I'm looking for that key. Oh, that's what I was, that's what I was saying. Yeah, I completely forgot why I mentioned this. If a level gets to be a certain size or bigger, I start losing track of the places I've been, places I haven't been. And then, of course, uh, you end up... Uh, or, not you, sorry, I end up not knowing where I'm going. Secret room, come on. No secret room. I keep on wanting to find a secret room. Because that's just my nature. I like going looking for stuff. Usually fail. Oh, we're at... Alright, we'll do the hammer. Yes, okay. Alright, that's gonna be a major upgrade with damage and speed. So I'm looking forward to that. Oh, actually, you know what? I could actually equip everything I've purchased before. So you don't have to beat the game relying on power-ups. This hammer doesn't feel that slow actually. Oh yeah, I don't have I don't have enough money to heal, but at the same time. Oh. Well. Alright, so the treasure chests and the secret rooms and everywhere else is just wooden crates. Uh I I don't like losing health because I'm jumping and the pla there's some enemy standing on the platform above me. And that's just how it is. Looks like uh, at least uh, we managed to stave off that death. Whoa. Alright, maybe I should go for some crits. Because <laughs> Looks like crits is how I'm going to be able to get one hit kills. Um, exit. Oh, oh, give me my coin back. Well, whatever. It's kind of funny that coin bounced up into the wall. It's like a little crevice. There's the key. That coin is still down there in that crevice. Well, okay, we're finally doing enough to those enemies that they're not, uh, they're becoming more casual. Uh, secret room? No secret room. Uh, where was the door? Like I said, I'm a complete idiot when it comes to sense of direction. I wasn't keeping track. We do have a map. Portal! Okay. Well, I was going the wrong direction, so I'm glad I looked there. <laughs> I was just right there. These levels are not that big. <laughs> Okay. 
Since when does a barbaric warrior wielding a big axe or hammer and destroying everything in his path get damaged uh, when he lands on the soft, very soft tip of a top hat of a mighty wizard who shoots fireballs? And not too mighty because he dies kind of quick. But secret room, nope, no secret room. And we're, we're, we're two hitting a lot of things. Still four hits for the wizard, even with the axe. Gosh. Those eyes are terrible. Okay. Uh, this is why. Uh, yeah, okay. We'll look for a secret room right here. No, there's no. No secret room there. I want to... I, I guess you know what I'm... Why is there only one boss for so many rooms? Whoops. You kind of expect to see a boss, mini boss, some sort of something, uh, at the end of the biome, right? Yeah, we're already on number, I don't know, biome number three, four. I can't remember. So starting, and then the ice, and then the less lushy green. So this is number four. Uh, this is more lushy green. I don't know what to call these biomes because. Secret room. No secret room. Hey, you can actually attack and back up. Oh, that's good to know. I guess I should have explored that. So you could actually slowly nudge your way away from uh, an attacking enemy. Oh, I don't want to stand on his head. Did not see a secret room. I wonder if there's a secret room in every floor or not really. Sometimes I feel like I'm pretty thorough in exploring. Alright, let's... Rapier. No, not enough money. Armor. Not enough money. Potions. Potion of life. That's just a HP boost, right? Dexterity. Sure. And... Stamina, dexterity... Strength. I'll go for the strength. Oh, I wanted to save us money to buy the rapier. Doesn't matter. All of a sudden, it feels like there's... Oh! Orc Chief, level 13. Ah! You hit so hard. Oh my goodness. Oh! Uh, glorious deeds, missions completed, cash bonus. There's no other option other than resurrect, so it's not a even a matter of. Let's. Well, I don't know. I want to try this boss again. At least we can say that we've made our way through a boss level, right? Yeah. Bosses there. All right. Well, let's. Uh, why does he have to hit so hard? It's not that hard to deal with. I'm taking damage because I am walking literally into his sharp spikes. Uh, I don't like the... I don't like the hitboxes, really. Uh, 
I don't like the hitboxes. Alright, we can buy the rapier and be on our way to be. I think this game, you can kind of see already, your character is just going to get super overpowered. And if you want a challenge, I suppose you could. Uh, I'm not going to heal, I'm going to level up. Well, who knows, maybe the next enemy set is going to be super hard. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, so maybe I want to invest some into crit. Um, I want that. Want that. Want that. It's going to be accessed from the other side. Okay, so you make a little bit more money. Uh, maybe I should have healed up. Maybe I should have healed up. Oof. Playing with fire there. Well, not exactly. F uh, I'm going to leave the wizard alone and go look for that secret room. Because that's how I'm going to... Okay, okay. Maybe I need to invest in some crits. Uh, wait, where is that secret room? I thought it was accessed from this side. Maybe I have to go down a little bit. Okay. Just don't want to die is all. Secret room, yay. All right. Uh, just, uh, even though I don't like seeing screen shake, and I really think that should be an option, uh, it seems totally reasonable to give crit chance up, uh, because having increased crit is seemingly... Originally I was just gonna go all strength, uh, just for the sake of it, um, but Looks like that's maybe not the best idea. But, I mean, you can play this game however you want. You could... Whoa. What is that? That sounds like a new enemy. Let's go explore. Yep, as soon as... Uh, it's a cannon. It's a cannoneer. Oh... Uh, Alright, wizards are still four hits. And... These gunners take a few hits to destroy. There's quite a few of them, apparently. Uh, I don't know what that guy is. Uh, a convict, maybe? Ah. Now I want money. There's something to be said about becoming overpowered, I guess. Um... this just let's see oh boy oh boy oh boy oh wait I only took one fireball damage really oh but I took three because he kicked my head as it peeked out underneath the platform Huh. So, not exactly... I mean, I get... I'm not even sure. I guess we'll do uh, Dexterity. 150. And one set... Oh, can't afford that one. That gives the Dexterity up. But, I mean, it, it, the, the character is just going to get completely OP by the time you get to the end game. Of course, the enemies will level up with you. 
but I guess that's how it's going to be. It's a pretty interesting platformer. It's coming out on Steam tomorrow, so I hope that at least you got to see a little bit about... Oh, you can look at your stats. Oh, quests! Those are... <laughs> I should have looked at that earlier. Oh, they're executioners. The first thing is just called eyes, skeletal... Oh, oh, they're only active three at a time. So you gotta... So I should... I should really be going after these creatures in order to uh, maximize my monies and benefits. Okay, and stats. Uh, okay, crit chance. Yes, we've killed 204 enemies and got healed three times. Or is that deaths? Resurrected three times, I bet. Uh, yeah, 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 that, that's gotta be what it is. Okay, cool. Pretty neat game and you can continue options. Options are as we expect, are just the same as beginning options. And so there you have it. Olaf's Emporium, found to be found everywhere. A, a king that has nothing but two dogs and you cannot pet the dogs. And he is not pretty pleased by the jester. Um, Neither am I, to be honest. This jester is juggling one ball back and forth. That is not a very exciting jester to be juggling one ball. That's that's one ball going between the left and the right hand constantly. There's no height difference, there's no nothing. I'll feed you to my dogs, says the king. Juggle faster, you fool. Okay. Worst jester ever! Uh, yeah, I'm surprised the Jester is still alive. Now he hasn't really pleased the king very much. It's also a very devoid castle. There's just Olaf's Emporium. A secret, mysterious portal that leads into the dungeon. Alright, alright, alright. That's... that's good enough. Enough? So the, the game works fine with both the joystick and the D-pad, just FYI. Um... Yeah, uh, pretty simple, straightforward platforming game. Um, you've already seen everything that it probably has to offer. It's going to have quite a few more bosses, clearly, but uh, you're not going to be able to see me play it. But uh, maybe if you want to find out what those bosses look like and how their attacks are, go find out and check out the game yourself. Again, game is coming out tomorrow. So I'll leave a link to the, game uh, to the store page in the description below. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. Bye-bye.